for anyone that's coming to state, I would just say that this university has really made, shaped me into the person that I'm that I am now. I don't think I would have this opportunity if I went anywhere else. And I love the people, I love the culture of the school, and I mean, I wouldn't trade my college years for anything. And as far as ROTC goes, it's a commitment, and you really, you have to have the right, right mindset, you have to be dedicated to it, but at the same time, I know next Friday on the 14th, when I pin on those bars, I will have a job. We have excellent problem-solving skills, and the even just the people skills that we learned through um, the chemical engineering department and um, our professors that we had will be a great asset. I also think too just the course load that's required and the amount of work that you have to put into doing well in the chemical engineering uh, curriculum has really prepared us to juggle multiple things and to really keep on top of our studies but also make time for ourselves and our social lives. But on top of that I think that our professors care about our students so much mm -hmm. and that's a, a really positive example I think especially since we're going to be officers and we're going to be in charge of people that I would I'm really going to take the lessons that they taught about being invested in our education and our careers and really try to apply that in the fleet as well. Yesterday morning we got a call from our lieutenants in the office that were asking us to come in for one interview and then that turned into two interviews and then three and then ten reporters were calling in for a phone <laughs> conference and at that point when we kind of got there and we are ready for it, it was just like wow and reading the list of um, reporters that were calling in, it was it was definitely an eye-opener, yeah. at least for me it was, and then being able to have friends at home being like, hey, I saw you on the news last <laughs> night, and that sort of thing. It's, it's kind of still a shocker.